Hello everybody. Today we have to go to Becky and Troy's so Don can fix the exhaust under the car in their garage and not have to lay in the snow here to do it. Right? Yeah. yeah, because we don't have a garage and if you would do it here, you'd have to lay right on the ground in this snow. Yeah. No fun, right? Nope. Just checking all the fluids. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Needed to be topped off with a little bit of any grease. Yeah. Hi, Tog. Too hot in the house, isn't it? 92 degrees in the house right now because of the wood stove. Too hot in there for you. getting started and he's got this is Bob's big jack and then wood and you're gonna put that aluminum flashing around the exhaust pipe so that it stops making a bunch of noise right yep well red next style yeah cheaper than what a garage would charge yeah <laughs> Don't push your wood too far. Is it nice and comfortable kneeling on those stones? <laughs> well, it ain't too bad if you got your knees in the right spot. Ugh. I don't want to pull it depending on the jack. Yeah. But anyway, the the snow is melting today because it's 34 degrees, which is nice. But it won't stay that way, unfortunately. Like over there, you can see the snow falling off the shed or getting ready to.
well, it doesn't sound perfect, but it sounds a whole lot better. It was bad enough be before that we could have gotten stopped by the cops and given a fine. Well, now we're home and it's time to get all this stuff in with these chickens. And they've already been going for uh, like 20, 26 and a half hours, or no, 27 and a half, I think. But anyway, if they aren't tender now, they're never going to be. They look like the air tender. <laughs> yep. Well, that's tender. what it, when when you get old chickens given to you. I I don't mean old like. Yeah. They were fresh yeah. when they were uh, well butchered. But they were old when they were alive. And they're going to have tough meat, so leave them in your slow cooker for 27 and a half hours, and that'll be good. And there. And now we can wait some more, because the potatoes and carrots are already cooked, but uh, we need the flavor to go through, and those onions have to be fully cooked. I do not like partially cooked onions. They're either cooked or they're raw, not in between. That's gross. There. It's all finally done. 6, 10 p.m. And I started it at 2 p.m. yesterday. So they're definitely tender. And I watched yesterday's video, and I know the things I've said in this video, and I think I might have confused you guys. The chicken as food is not old. The chickens, when they were alive, were old. We're not eating old, nasty food that's been sitting around forever. When these chickens were given to us, they were as fresh as you can get, like just minutes fresh so hopefully that clarifies a little because I think I made it sound like we were eating old yucky food that's been sitting in the freezer for like years and no that's not true and White Storm has been waiting patiently for this chicken since yesterday since two o'clock yesterday so we'll have to make sure he gets a bite or two right? You think so? yeah cuz look he waited and waited and waited all this time Aw. Hey, Tug. I suppose you want chicken too, right? Well, you'll end up with a bite or two, too. Also, as well. You're a good boy. And there we go. That's the finished product. That chicken cannot get any more tender than that. So dinner was good and definitely plenty tender enough and he got plenty of the chicken he's been waiting for since 2 p.m. yesterday are you happy now everybody got chicken and gizzard and smoky are running around like they're nuts they just ran out of here not much is going on for the rest of the night so i guess we're gonna go ahead and say good night and we hope you enjoyed the video and that you like, subscribe, comment, share, and you're having a good night. Your turn. Good morning. And we'll see you next time.